bedroom here and I don't understand what's going on. I think I just died. <clears throat> I'm still using the front facing camera because I don't want to use the back camera because I can't fucking see what I'm doing on there. Yeah, so if this video looks really weird, it's because I'm using the front camera. So, wow, this lighting is, this might be the best lighting I've ever had on my entire channel. It's fucking LA, man. I swear to God, you moved to LA and you finally figure out how to become a YouTuber. Plot twist, this whole vlog has been me moving into my new LA apartment. That wasn't funny. Okay. Anyways, so today's the last day. My mom, my mom, what? She didn't even go with me. My dad already left. So his flight was at like 8 a.m. in the morning. Okay, I can't hold this. This is so heavy. Much better. No, actually, no. All right, sorry. I couldn't hold that. It was way too heavy. My arm was actually shaking. <coughs> so, so far what I've done is I woke up, took a shower, got ready to pack. And then, I don't know, I might maybe Uber to get coffee or a juice. Oh, a juice. I'm so LA. Or maybe just get the breakfast in the lobby, but I feel like I shouldn't stay in the lobby. I don't know. All in all, though, this trip has been really fun. I didn't really do like a lot of insane things because I was with my dad, but I did just like go to all these different places. Like, first of all, we went to Laguna Beach. Literally no words. Like, I will live there when I'm older. It is so beautiful. I like literally think it's illegal to get stressed out there, honestly, because everyone was just so relaxed, like no knots in any backs. Like <laughs> everyone just looked great. I felt great. I got a sweatshirt. I filmed in that sweatshirt. Should I go get it? No, I'm not going to go get it because I'm lazy. Yeah, and then we went to Malibu and drove down Highway Coast 1. Wait. And drove down Highway 1. Like, I think it's the Pacific Coast Highway. Whatever it is. Li uh, see, like, doing things like that and driving down that highway just really made me wonder why my parents decided to move to um, Illinois. I'm not really sure what their reasoning was behind it because I really just don't understand why when there's places like that with mountains and beaches and hills and bliss, you choose gray skies and literal cornfields. Maybe that's just a personal opinion, but I just really don't understand what their thought process was there and I just... Um, like, I'm literally looking at a palm tree right now, and I just feel better about myself because of that palm tree. Do you get it? Okay. My favorite part about Malibu, I think, was looking at all the houses I will never be able to afford on the beach. It was really good for, like, my ego and, like, my self-preservation. I really felt accomplished after that, and everyone's probably going to scream at me and be like, George, you're literally 18. Like, l shut up. You're actually a child. You don't need to be successful yet. And, well... Tell that to the like 16 year olds making TikTok Viner people who literally make like a million dollars a year. Okay, like why didn't I do that? You know, that's really all I have to say. This trip was actually amazing. I'm so thankful that like I was able to go on this trip and be with my dad. Oh, I do. I do. Uh, I do have something to say. Okay, so I didn't really film a lot during this trip. A lot of it has just been like sit down talking about the trip because um, one, I'm still only using my phone for all of this. So I'm not, there's no professionability, professionalism. There's no professionalism when it comes to any of this. <clears throat> the throw me into the chopping block, the scissors, the chopping teeth, the teeth of terror, you know what, throw, it's like throw me into the goddamn Pacific Ocean and see if I drown or not. The answer is I'm drowning. Sorry if I don't film a lot. I'm gonna try and film the most I can without being literally the most awkward, annoying person ever. Beauty. Oh, I'm gonna go to the lobby now and get some, um, just breakfast. They have like muffins and shit and coffee. I'm probably gonna have like three because I think it's complimentary. If it's not, that's gonna be really annoying. Um, yeah. Also, I just remembered this. I didn't say this earlier, but so last night I was like, I'm gonna order chicken fingers. It's late. I'm hungry. There's room service. So the chicken fingers were $38. 
I'm not sure what's going on. I understand that this is LA and Beverly Hills or whatever, but I mean, that's kind of a hate crime. If you ever come here, never order chicken fingers because they're not that good and they're definitely not worth $38. Hi guys, sorry if it's really loud in here, but I forgot to film what I was eating. So they're already half gone, but I guess I'll film it now. I was really feeling health conscious today. So I really decided to go, you know, on the lighter end of things, I only started with, um, yeah, a cinnamon bun. I don't really know. And then just a plain croissant, you know, plain Jane over here. They're looking really good. Obviously very healthy choices, very body conscious about what I'm eating. Don't worry everyone. I got my iced coffee with soy milk. So I'm still a skinny legend. So I'm in LAX alone, and I got here way too fucking early. I have like two hours until my flight. So I really have no idea what to do right now. I've been walking around aimlessly for 30 minutes. Um, I got this. And yeah, there's literally nowhere to sit because I guess the entire city decided let's take a flight today. I'm also doing this in the corner because I'm terrified and people are watching me and I'm feeling really insecure, so. That's always a really good time. That's my update for now. I'll see you guys later.